I'm going to tell you one very important, uh, you know, if your tongue stick out, if you see in the back or the side area have a, the like a storm, strawberry dot, there's red dots. But sometimes, you know, if you have a white coating background, see the three dots, you can see very clear. Sometimes, you know, you don't have that white background, you need a refractor. I have lots of experience, I can tell right away. So people have those dots, that's estrogen problem, hormone problem. Most people have that one. It's, uh, most is estrogen dominant. For teenager, that's right, that's okay. That's hormone change. But after 18, 19 years old, the girl, if you see still have those red dots, they can be going to uh, the endometriosis, the, the ovarian cyst. And uh, uh, also the easy one, just PMS, okay. But they can be leading to breast cancer, uh, fibroids, or the uterine fibroids, or endometriosis cancer, or very, very important. So when you become 30, 40, still see the three, three dots, you really need to reduce estrogen. Then for men, same thing, you have those one, for men, over 20, you see the dots there, you start looking for your testicle area. I don't want the testicle to have a cyst or even cancer. And then for men, uh, 40, 50, you have that dots, the chance to go to prostate cancer. So you need to check your PSA, check your estradiol. Estradiol level should be in the 30. But the PSA is very important by age. You know, when, uh, three years ago, European Journal published that if your PSA uh, when you're 50 years old, your PSA over 0.68, uh, you have a high chance eventually prostate cancer. If you're 55, your PSA 0.85, 0.85, your high chance of prostate cancer. 